Hello, through the makeup, here welcome to another episode of Let's Pray Tales of Symphonia. Wow, um, I believe that Gina be said the place we're looking no for was, was to the, uh, oh, I should be focusing on the wolf here. Um, they do seem to sort of run around and change positions a lot more than Greeks did in the other world. Anyway, um, yeah, I believe that we're supposed to be going to the, uh, to the, uh, north here. That was just warming up. Or not the north here, the north. North! This, I'm assuming means that I need to make my way around this mountain. Wow, there's a... There's a thing here. Path. Not much of a path though. Oh right, well the the thing that seems closest on the map, the red dot on the map is up here. So perhaps it's actually up this way. Yeah, it's not up this way, this is just back to the mountain again. I'm just gonna look for a path and follow it. This is sort of north from here, just not directly north from here. Not much of a specimen. You are no no ah, new people. Well, newish people. They are just going to behave like the old people did. Are you okay? Ready? Let's go, Corinne. But even talk the same. Are you okay? Perfect. Alright! Well, this is where we're supposed to go. Oh, yeah, I think it was the Imperial City we had before. Would have been nice to get more more summoned things and and stuff from her. More fighting, but never mind. Yeah, it does, um, it does look a bit different. I think it's got its own sort of colour scheme, for example. Of course, there's still some narties. Well, 
Well, she's not really Colette anymore, is she? Yeah, I've I've always liked Violent. Never mind. These people don't probably don't have anything interesting to say. Oh, but it's up to him. Alright, let's have a look at their shops first. And we could probably do with um with heating out actually. So. I don't know though. We do do seem to have a lot of um of ex of uh of health, yeah, that's not I don't know if these people say anything interesting. Perhaps, uh, perhaps I should not find out. I think since I don't actually have a lot of money that I should uh, save some of that money for the moment for any uh, anything that I need more, I guess. Ah, oh, this is a slums, okay. Sorry, this is this is taking a while, and I'm just kind of wandering around. I'm not sure of my way yet. It might be possible that they don't sell fighting items here, in which case, uh, fair enough. Yeah. No, I guess they don't. Okay, well, before I leave the city, I might grab some more items. But for now, I think I'm gonna leave it and go and go up here. Hey, watch it! Watch where you're going! Now, now, settle down, my darling honeys. Hi there, my little cool beauty. Are you hurt? But Master Zellos himself has deigned to speak to this girl, and yet look how she acts! I'm not sure she's really in charge of how she acts, to be honest. Just look at her. It's not even festival time, and yet she's dressed up in an angel costume. How stupid are you? Can you believe the nerve of this hag? What did you say? Genus, let it go. She's obviously never looked in a mirror. What did you say? You're all behaving like children. Now, now, settle down. Are you upset, my little angel? You know, I bet you're as cute as a button when you smile. <laughs> That was a surprise. You sure are strong, my little angel. You certainly startled me. I don't think your charms are working on her. Well, who are you? No offense, but I'm not interested in talking to guys. I hate this guy already. 
Ooh, what's your name, beautiful? Give me your name and I'll give you mine. Hey, you copied Lloyd. Uh, now that I've heard someone else say it, it sounds kind of arrogant. Oh, my, you don't know me? Well, well, I guess I still have a ways to go. <laughs> Master Zellos, let's go! Oh, yes, yes, of course. Well then, I'll see you again. Um, isn't for women <laughs> enough for you? My lovely lady, my cute little angel, and, uh, you other people. S seriously, do you not sometimes get a bit confused or forget someone's name or something? What was that all about? What an ass! He was grinning like an idiot the entire time! What's wrong with that guy? He had an X-sphere on him. What? No way! So that's how he reacted so fast. Just who is that guy? It's probably the uh, chosen of um, Dathiala. Won't surprise me that much. We know the um, we know we're supposed to be an idiot, so. Um, no, she's an actual angel. That's the difference. Um. Before I go to the cathedral, let's go to the past. Yeah, look, I've got a letter, mate. Maybe it's a requirement or all be self top beards. That looks like a very heavy sacred wood. She appeared to not be going outside, but doesn't appear to well be going inside. Well then, I'll let so. you get to work. The sacred wood goes to Altamira. You can do it after your current job is done. Understood. The plan is right on schedule. I must report to Lord Rodile. Hey! Hang on a sec! Um... Prisea! Could we have a moment of your time? I'm Lloyd. This is Colette and Rain and... I I'm Genus! Hey, Genus, why are you all flushed? Would you let us help you carry the sacred wood? W wait! I'm sorry, I know this is a bit strange, but please hear us out. The truth is, we have a letter we wish to give to the king. Our friend's life depends on it, but we have a problem because the king is sick and refuses to see anyone. It would really help us out if we could carry it for you. Uh, are you listening? Understood. Okay. Um, 
Prisea, please carry that. Oh, okay. Leave it to us. So it doesn't seem to be very talkative. Oh my. So enough. Wait, wait a minute. Gah, this thing is heavy. I've lost all confidence as a man. Me too. Well, you could have tried dragging it by the handle like she did. Anyway, let's follow her. Yeah, there's, there's nothing at all suspicious about us coming here, you telling us to go away, and then us mysteriously uh, going with her to deliver the sacred wood. So yeah, I don't know if you're going to be helping us fight or not. But let's fix things, because now I've put you as our main person. There we go. Right. What do you like, Sia? Okay. That uh, the character seems to go at the same level as us. It's probably a bad idea to run into the guards. I don't know, like, we have, we have to see all this. Perhaps as long as I don't insist on fighting them.
Yeah. It's kind of awkward. <laughs> now people try to get us normally don't get very far. I hate to say it, but this is probably the best solution we've got right now. I mean, the other solutions are this well gets destroyed and um, she dies, or uh, they kill that, and uh, Tafiara continues to to be. Um, Flourishing, but uh, Silverant is destroyed. More, uh, otherwise, I'm just staring at my computer screen for the next ten minutes, aren't I? Personally, I like the idea of that not becoming an angel. I think that's a great idea. Damn charmed, I'm sure. I suppose I can look around, although, to be fair, I'm not sure I'm actually going to find anything interesting here. That's where you know what? Nah. I don't think there's anything to be found here, really. Well, uh, I guess that's it for this episode. I will see you next time. <laughs>